thousand. But uh, he'll pick it up sooner. <laughs> he'll pick it up sooner rather than later. I promise you that much. No worries. Free flop given and uh, thirty thousand in there. Just crucial money for either side. And uh, in the spirit of the game, they've all missed the flop. But well, all three okay. of them have shown, <laughs> shown a propensity okay. for larceny. <laughs> <laughs> Great time for Martin, uh, for Norman Whiteside Old to make check. a move, but he checks it. Here's the turn. Will Marcel be moving now? Well, you know, Marcel and uh, Smith in particular have been uh, messing around with okay. one another and checking top check. pair to one another. Uh, sort check. of a, a check match upside down, nearly stronger than a bet at this stage. <laughs> <laughs> what a big card for Marcel Lusk. Now he has incentive to check, check. it out. Yeah, all thoughts of larceny have gone out the window. <laughs> oh! Just as Marcel Lusk found it. <laughs> got a card in the river he could check with there. I'll tell you what. If there, if there's voting going on for the man of the match right now. <laughs> the phone lines are jammed. <laughs> Well, I have to might give a man of the match before we started. <laughs> Talk about I owe the man. What can I? What can I say? Pass. Pass. I mean, how important was that thirty thousand? If Norman Whiteside had checked there, Parik, thirty thousand would have gone into Marcel <coughs> Lusk's stack. He would have basically been the chip leader. Instead, Norman Whiteside has taken those chips away from Holland and uh, kept them in Northern Ireland's stack. It's, it's just massive that move. But it's taken a round and a half of the table away from uh, from Marcel, basically. I mean, at this stage of the tournament, it's huge. Lines going up, cards going akimbo. Funny? Only if you're a pain master. All the pressure and all the nerves. There are no nerves on this table. Northern Ireland, Holland, hell to pay. No one to play with? There's always PartyPoker.com. Lines are moving around, and Glenn Helder will be second to speak here, and not really in a position to afford Park letting the blinds go by. Now he's going to have to start making a move very, very soon. Pass. Pass. Time Pass. is not right, he says. Lusk from the button. Oh, those fives are popular. Raise all in. <laughs> no. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Well, Park, this is the first big break we've seen in this game. I'm all in as well. All in. Lusk has moved with a pair, and Martin Smith has woken Best up with a big in. hand. It's a beautiful spot for Martin Smith. He's, uh, he's almost between 5 to 2 and 3 to 1 on here. And he's also got a... Uh, he's going to have 70 or 80,000 left even if he loses. I mean, he's still got an average stack if he loses this pot. It's... Well, this could be the break in the game. I was looking the wrong hand. Four's on shot. Marcel Lusk is all in, and Smith has him well covered. So it's kind of amazing if Lusk hadn't have woken up or anything. Noah Buchan might be all in right now. He had an ace. Well, in fact, Noah would be in better shape. It's Noah who's the five to two on, five to two on shot against the Kings with the ace nine. Huh? The oh, there's a five! Oh my! Who would have thought? It, 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 it looks like it doesn't matter what <laughs> what Dutch player <laughs> Marty Smith plays against. <laughs> or what Holy. they need. Holy cow! I, I mean, I mean, you would have bet your boots that Northern Ireland was all of a sudden going to wrap this tournament up. But uh, how big is this for the Dutch team when you think back over these first two rounds, time and time again? The Dutch team has been on the floor. Well, uh, Noah got himself out of, out of, out of several traps, oh, uh, several of them of his own making. 
No, Marcel, who's, uh, I mean, who, who hasn't had a break since this tournament started. <laughs> he, all of a sudden hit form at just the right time. He finally dogged somebody. I mean, Marcel's form turned around when he got knocked out of the World Series in 10th place about three years ago. And this card could be the start of something new. He's too good a player, Parg, not to use this to his advantage. Well, when a player like as good as Marcel does get a break, you know, they, they tend to go on and convert. You know, it's, it's, it's part of the game. How is this for a turnaround in the leaderboard? The Dutch team now out in front, and they've got their captain with the chips. The Irish captain has the second most, but it's only about a farthing more than he started with. Who would have thought we'd be so deep into this quarterfinal match with still six remaining, but it shows how much everyone wants it. And uh, this this match, I mean, this could be a final right here. It, it, these teams are both fantastic. Although uh, right now, as far as depth goes, Pass. Northern Ireland is doing what they have to do to keep all their players in. The Netherlands is uh, pretty happy that they're in. Pass. Reasonable, Nick. Pass. We've got blind on blind here. Lusk and Smith have clashed so many times. And they've got a little bit of history tonight, haven't they? I wouldn't be surprised if Marcel moves all in. Race all in. I think. Seems as you wouldn't believe it. Seems as you wouldn't believe it. Well, he's not going to believe it when Marcel turns over his hand either. <laughs> he's, in a, he's, he's in pretty good shape for two kings here. <laughs> Lusk turned Martin Smith's two kings like over before like with the two fives. I know, I know the medicine. That was about an 18% <laughs> shot. Now he's about 14% with the, with the king ten of clubs. Uh, It'd be out of a double. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody have two tens? <laughs> 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 to be honest, I don't go for kings. I'm honest. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I don't win this, I won't. To be very honest, I bet you probably, I bet he'd like to swap hands right now. <laughs> give, give them a go just for old time's sake. But to be very honest, confidence. Oh, I'll tell you what, Martin <laughs> has just flopped three kings, but he is scared. A jack par at four hours now, I've hardly any out before. Jack of hearts. A uh, Jack and Marcel Lusk will have done the impossible. Well, it's going to have to be a Jack that isn't a diamond now. Because a uh, Jack of diamonds would make Marty Smith as a, a, what do you call it? A blue. <laughs> Three cards in the deck. And Lusk has just missed. King's full for Martin Smith. That is the hand he needs to beat the Dutch captain. Yeah. And well, it's, it's a flip-flop, isn't it? That's what you did. It was pretty fair, anyway. <laughs> I don't think Marty Smith is going to be telling you it's pretty fair. <laughs> I think he, he, 